I don't like not being good at things I've said I'd be good at. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, Elaine and I have had kind of a quiet enough start to the day. We've taken the dog out for a walk and we're just getting ready to have our lunch now. And in case you're wondering, yes, my hair is kind of fluffy. And the reason for that is because I haven't put any gel into it. And the reason for that is because Elaine is going to cut my hair in a little while. Elaine's mom is going to call because she's a hairdresser, so she's basically gonna talk Elaine through what she needs to do with my hair, and then Elaine is gonna cut my hair. But what she's going to use for cutting my hair is this stuff. So this is a thinning scissors that she's going to be using on the top part of my head. And actually this thinning scissors is for cats and dogs, as you can see there because we were trying to order one on Amazon and we couldn't get them to ship it here from the UK because there seemed to be some issue with shipping scissors for some reason. But when we looked online, we found actually one of the local pet shops here uh, were selling them on their website. So they sent it out to us. And the other thing that we ordered is this. So this is a Wall Color Pro cordless hair clipper. We ordered that on the 3rd of April and it arrived on Thursday. What's funny about the hair clipper is that when we ordered it on Amazon, I think it was 35 pounds sterling. And now if you look at the same clippers, it's 75 pounds sterling. So obviously because of COVID-19 and not being able to go and get your hair cut, everyone is obviously having the same thought and trying to get their hair cut at home, which means that demand for these things is through the roof. So the price has gone way up. But we were lucky that we were able to get this one before the price went up, because there's no way that I would have spent 75 pounds on that thing. So in the box comes this little bag. So we'll be keeping this bag. And inside the bag, I'm too careful opening this, we have all of the guards for the hair. We have the actual cordless hair clipper itself. It seems to be pretty good, like it seems to be good quality. It's good value for 35 pounds. Don't think it's worth 75 pounds though. So, yeah. Looking forward to getting my hair cut in a little bit because it's just like, particularly at the sides, it's so long and it's the same at the back. Like I can nearly like pull it at the back. But yeah, it's not gonna stay this way. Uh, so I'm curious to see how this all goes and I'm confident that Elaine will be able to do a good job cutting my hair because she's good at this kind of thing and if it all goes wrong we can always shave it all off anyway so either way should be fun. halfway through the hair cutting now and I think Elaine's doing a pretty good job. I can't really see a lot of what's happening but Elaine's Probably mom best. <laughs> Elaine's mom has been talking her through it and it sounds like it's going well. How are you finding the razor? Fine yeah I just feel like at the back I don't know if I got it as good so I'm actually going to just use the two right now just to try and tidy those bits that I was doing but I think I'm just being a little bit over critical. <laughs> We're all done, thankfully, because I am covered in hair and I don't think I've ever been so itchy in my entire life. But I think I look way better already. And are you happy with how it looks? Yeah, I am, yeah. I, I know I'll just be like at it all yeah. 
You bet. So I won't, I won't go near it again. No. So I'm gonna run up and have a shower now and then style it and you guys will see exactly what it's like then. Just in case you're wondering how much hair we took off, that is Ronan's hair and this is my hand for scale. And then there's some dust that was in the kitchen. So that's like a puppy, a puppy full of hair. So this is now what my hair looks like after I'm showered and changed and have all the dead hair washed off me and feel like a new person. So I really like it. I think it looks like the sort of haircut that I would pay for. I'm not hugely happy with like the bits here and here. Okay. And on this, like, I'll show you. Yeah. So I feel like here, it's, it almost looks patchy even though it's not. It's just Ronan has this dent in his head. Would you hear this say? And then up here, I don't think it's as good, but I, I can fix it, but I just, my mom was like, don't do anything to it. And then on this side, it's actually better. There's a slight, almost like a line or something, but I think in general, even bend your head down. Yeah. Like even in general, the cut and everything at the top, like I took loads off and I think that you overall look better. And I think mm. what's wrong with this is that this will actually grow out in another, like you're not going back to work for another week. So, no. and I think the camera makes it look worse than it actually is. Hopefully. The camera lies. <laughs> This is my new hair for the foreseeable future. And I am very happy with it. I have put my hoodie back on and now I'm just gonna put the kitchen back together because obviously the table's not meant to be there. I'm gonna basically put the place back together and take it easy now for the rest of the day. So I'm gonna leave this video here. I hope you like it. I hope you like my new haircut. If you do, please give it a big thumbs up, the haircut and the video. Please subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in the next one.